right, so here he is, the former UFC interim lightweight champion, Tony Ferguson, and here's a guy who a lot of these fellow lightweights. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, so here we go, round one, Khabib Nurmagomedov versus Tony Ferguson. I remember after Tony Ferguson beat Edson Barboza. That's the first time they tried to put this fight together five years ago. Locked the door behind him. It's going to be a fantastic quick entry to get on a single. A great oh. What a fantastic takedown. Welcome to the Cormier Express. <laughs> Inside the close, Nurmanko Medoff's looking for an arm bar here. Arms in deep. Oh, looks like to me. Oh, how good is that as he gets out? That is great submission defense, keeping everything short and not allowing his opponent to get the submission victory. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Right early round one action here, and the wrestler immediately is able to get the clinch. Seems to be a means to an end. He's going to try to take this one. Absolutely, John, and he wants to wear on the He understands how powerful his boxer is. So by grabbing him, squeezing him, making him squeeze, it starts to build the lactic acid. The arms start to blow up, and you start to get a little fatigue. That's what this wrestler's trying to do to slow his boxing down. Oh! Back to his feet. wasn't able to finish the job, and now his opponent's back in the fight. I mean, you don't get those opportunities very often. You got to take full advantage of them when they're presented to you. Oh, he's got his back. Oh, nicely done there as he escapes back to his feet. Oh, beautiful takedown by him there as he lands another one. He's keeping the stat guys busy tonight. I mean, over and over, takedown attempt after takedown attempt, and the cardio. The cardio to wrestle that much is so impressive because the opponent is getting back to his feet, but he's got this ability to continue to chase takedowns. All right, late round action here. Khabib Nurmagomedov continuing to dominate the action. Beautiful transitions, and I'm not sure anybody mixes their wrestling and their grappling as well as this guy. I mean, oh, what a connection by him there. His opponent could be out of here soon, DC. Well, you can hit with a shot like that. You don't know whether to run, hide, grab, or wrestle. He's a, he, I mean, he's picked up. All right, so now blood is a back. Quick entry here. High single leg entry. Oh! oh my God, he switched the arm to a high cross, rotated him, and took him for a ride. That was a big takedown. That dust choke is tight. Oh, he caught out. How good is that? This guy is so aware. He never leaves anything long to allow for himself to get subbed. Oh! He's in trouble. Oh, and now an uppercut. Big combination. All right, so the round is over. You see, obviously, the fighter has a cut on his cheek sustained in that round, but better to be below the eye than above it. The cut man is in there trying to close it up. All right, so there's the end of the round, and on one side, thrill on the other agony after that knockdown. Yeah, he was able to really damage him with that big punch. You see the hands, the speed, how sharp he is, how tech. Ready to fight? Ready. Round two on the way. Quick level change. Oh, he see. went through. He's the line. Oh, the air. What a massive takedown. Well, anytime you are in a ground fighting situation with this fighter, you're potentially playing with fire. Get the ball here. He's got the hooks in, DC, working off of his back. Now look for him to attack the neck of his opponent to try to get the rear choke. Side control now. Right to the knee on belly. Gains great posture and starts raining down punches. If his opponent does not move, this fight is going to be stopped. Oh, he's got the knee on the belly. Could be trouble defensively. Mm, that was nice. All right, half guard form here, and a lot of offensive options, I would think, at his disposal. Oh, he's got a ton of options. He has submission options, but I believe the safest option for him here is going to be to use his ground and pound. Build a base, 
posture of aerobic strikes, get back to position, and posture again, aerobic strikes, and just really wear him down with a really secure position. It's happening. Beautiful combination by the champion there. Ferguson's eye starting to swell now. Oh, nice right hand from Khabib Nurmagomedov. DC will talk so much about the wrestling and the grappling. The quick level oh. Drops down inside the now closed guard of his opponent. Let's see how patient he is as he attacks a submission or big ground and pound. Well, as my favorite rap group Onyx would say, stick and move, right? Uh. Beautiful slip off the center line there. Yeah, what a great job of that. It doesn't take much to avoid a punch. Well, he has really picked up the pace here in round two. Double leg shot. Oh, he slams his opponent to the canvas. I think the octagon shaking this. The octagon was shaking. Somebody secure the doors because they are going to blow the roof off of this place. Oh, somehow he gets out. Fantastic submission, D. Oh, that rear naked choke looks good. Back trying to set up a choke here. Ooh, out triangles in tight. It's getting in very tight. Oh, how on God's green earth did he get out? Back to the stand up now. Both fighters up. just before you heard the horn, so he gets saved by the bell. The question is, though, what type of condition will he be in when he gets up off that stool? 60 seconds here to recover. The onus is on his corner to keep his head in the foot. All right, so there's the end of the round. He stayed committed to doing damage upstairs and landed the seminal blow in that round. You ready to fight? You ready? Here yeah. we go, third round of this championship fight. Magomedov gets hit with that hook. He's got to be careful here. Oh, he lands another strike to the body here. Really starting to connect on a lot of strikes to the midsection here in the latter stages of this fight. All right, so perhaps he's going to have to address something defensively. There is a legitimate cut. Oh, right there. His opponent's compromised, DC. It's one thing to land a hard shot. It's another thing completely to land a perfect shot. That was a perfect shot. Well, he's able to get back up here, but oh, man, is he on wobbly legs. Superman oh, man. Changes levels. Oh, man. Superman in his inner signals out to a high crotch. All right, full guard here, DC. What does he need to do to improve position? What? Arm triangle attempt here. Nice arm triangle setup. Oh, that arm triangle's wicked tight. He's starting to get it in very deep. Oh, that's got to be it. Oh, somehow, some way, he got out. These guys are back and forth. Submission defense wins this transition. Good job by the champ there. Slide back up. All right, so the fighter's setting up another sub attempt here. Oh, that looks tight. Might be the beginning of the end. You got to be kidding me. He's out. Well, he has expended a lot of energy right going This might be the biggest shot of this entire fight. He lands a massive hook to put his opponent on wobbly legs. All right, well, both fighters pretty comfortable on the ground, DC, but you got to be very careful hanging out here for too long if you're his opponent. All these actions, though, these big actions got to wear on the gas tank of both guys. Well, you know this is the hurt business, and both guys are compromised at this stage of the fight. Yeah, both guys are compromised. Both are pausing the action here, and if the referee calls for the doctor, this could very well be the end of the fight, given all that swelling around the eye. It could be, and rightfully so. His eye is swollen shut. He cannot see his opponent. He's flailing at him. Can't find his target anymore. I think they're going to stop this fight. I stand corrected. Doctor's going to allow them to continue, but he's going to have to go for it, I would think. Yeah, he will. He's got to make some adjustments. And also, he's going to have to lay it all out on the line. 
He cannot stay back and get picked apart as he has to this point. All right, so the ringside position has made his way back to his seat. The referee gets the action back underway. The fans are excited. This fight's going to continue. <laughs> So far, a frantic pace as expected. All right, so a nice straight punch there after he caught the leg. He decides to punch out as opposed to going for any takedown. Ferguson gets the single leg takedown. Well played. Oh, he's stepping over the hand here. This is tight. All right, while well, he continues to manhandle him here on the ground, now maybe trying to get to a choke position here, DC. All right, so another round is in the books. He found his range early, certainly found it again in that round. Stunned his opponent there yet again. His striking is on point. Really a clinic tonight from Nurmago Meta. All right, there's the end of the round. So it was a huge strike to the head that stunned his opponent and, and nearly got him out of there. Yeah, that was a big moment. A big strike lands. His opponent's on wobbly legs. That is exactly what you, what you want to see as you're walking back to your stool. Your opponent's staggering back to his corner and being hopeful that he can get it back together before the start of the next round. You ready to fight? Ready. Fourth round now, fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. All right, so here we go, fourth round is underway. What is the fighter's mentality when you enter those seminal championship rounds? You understand that you are getting close now. The night is almost over. The goal is within reach. Oh, gotta keep pressing here. Back to the feet now. Now land the clean. Now goes in and secures the takedown. Oh. Looping left hand misses the target. Oh, he landed it perfectly. Perfect placement. Perfect position. What a huge blow in a big moment in this fight. Oh, nice takedown, yep. All right, so he's got the body locked down here, DC, or so it appears. This is not a guy you want anywhere near your back. Ferguson's able to transition back to side control now. Oh, right into mouth. El Cuckoo's got his back yet again. This is a terrible position. Well, good dexterity and movement here on the ground to avoid any further damage, courtesy of that ground and pound. Nice job off of his back. Well, you gotta think it's only a matter of time. Yup, referee stopping the action here. That swelling is getting out of control. This might be the end, DC. It's bad. I mean, it's a lot of swelling. And it's the damage that he has taken over the course of the fight that is making him swell to a point that I don't know if he can continue. Well, this is a good sign. The doctor talking to the referee. And the fight will continue, at least for now. Yeah, this is a good decision. I mean, Ready. swelling can be superficial. He seems like he wants to compete. Let's go. Single leg takedown attempt here. Did that get you out of your seat? Beautifully done by him there. Oh, man. Oh, in good position to rip off a Kimura here. Ooh, that Kimura looks tight. Wow, somehow, some way, he gets the arm out. It looked like he was done, John, but he was able to stay comfortable Stay patient, and now he finds himself safe. Just out of range with the straight left hand. Now he's masterful from here. Oh, he went to it. Oh! Nice big takedown. What a technique. What a takedown. Great high impact skill. You could feel the canvas reverberating here. The I mean, right there. Bo -bo 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 -bo. It's like me running in a <laughs> like he was done, but he was able to slip the arm out and stay safe. Working for the submission once again. He's fighting. He wants it very bad. He got out again. Attempting a choke now. Oh, my goodness. That dark choke is very tight. Oh, he's got the choke. He's got the choke. It's over. Everybody in this
Alex Arena still digesting this result. What a win for him tonight, and he gets it done by submission, no less. He said he was going to get it done by submission. To watch an athlete call the shot is always fun. He should be very proud. All right, let's take a look back at the replay as he gets it done by submission tonight, champ. He was able to get the fight to the ground exactly where he wanted it. Eventually, his opponent gave him an opportunity to get a submission. He did that, and he should be very proud of the work he did tonight in the octagon. The official decision is in. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 38 seconds of round number four. Declaring the winner by tap out and still the undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world, Habib the Eagle Nurmagomedov. All right, so Habib Nurmagomedov had a